Hey, what is up guys? It is King Alpha here and welcome back everyone to a brand new video here on the channel today ladies and gentlemen we will be unlocking the Orion camo in Modern Warfare 2. Guys make sure to drop a like on today's video, subscribe and ding that bell it only takes you guys a second out of your day and it helps me and the channel out a lot. I greatly appreciate it guys. I mean come on we we freaking unlocked Orion camo in Modern Warfare 2 if that doesn't deserve a like. I don't know what freaking does guys so I would greatly appreciate it. Drop a like and if you guys want you can join the discord server link down in the description to be part of the Z Army gang here on YouTube. But enough chit chat, let's get into it guys. So we're, we are using the intervention. Here's the class if you guys are interested. We're using the new boys camo, which is this uh, season's event camo, which is really dope by the way. So was this one. This one's really sick too. Um, I was going to use the fall camo, but I was like, eh, nah, we won't. Yeah, so as usual guys, we just need 25 headshots. Now here's the thing. You may have seen it from the title. We are going to be trying to hit a trick shot. Now, it's not going to be a crazy off the top ropes, double Y, Y, you know, uh, throwing knife, 360, <laughs> no scope headshot, right? I'm not a trick shotter by any means. So, it's just going to be more of a casual thing. Oh, this site is very zoomed in. Hold up, I may need to change sites. Good lord above. And I still missed the head. <laughs> but yeah, so I do want to go for a trick shot. I think it would be pretty sick. Using an intervention. Going for a... Um, going for a trick shot. It just kind of makes sense, right? This is going to be really hard. I'm, I'm going to have to change sides. The site that I found the easiest to do this with was... Where is it? Was it this one? Yeah, the DS Far Sight 11. I found it really easy to get uh, my headshots with this. This is what I use for my snipers. It's really good. I'll tell you guys the worst thing about sniping. It is absolutely the flinch, dude. The flinch is so bad. And it doesn't help, dude, that on shipment, like, it doesn't matter what weapon you use. I can use pistols. I can use snipers. I'm dropping about a 50 kills every single game. But it sucks, dude, because th obviously that's activating the skill-based matchmaking, and I'm getting into, like, sweaty lobbies. I mean, we're talking about people that are, like, using the best guns in the game, going for the win, trying to spawn trap, and, you know, just... Oh, there's a headshot. You know what I mean? Just, like, literally sweating their balls off, and it's just so annoying, because it's like, I'm just sitting here grinding gamos. Like, why? Why me? Like, why am I getting put into these lobbies, man? Like, I miss the old matchmaking, dude, because it was like, you'd still get put in with a few few bots, you know? It'd be a lot easier to get these uh, camos done. There's a few bots in the lobby. The only bot in this lobby is me, bro. <laughs> oh, what a, wow, what a headshot. Holy. Damn. That'd be crazy. Oh, yo, imagine. Oh, wait, is it? Wait, I'm just, I'm insane. Oh, oh, I'm, na I'm nasty with it. I'm nasty. I'm jiggy with it. Oh, I missed that. Of course I do. But yeah, genuinely, guys, for anyone who's was doing the camel grind and stopped because of platinum or anything else. Go for it, guys. I'm recommending... Oh, I'm laggy now. I recommend you guys go for it. It was so easy. Like, the fact that I could do it in one day is absurd. <laughs> it was so easy, but it was so enjoyable. Now, if you guys know me, you know, I am a grinder at heart. I love grinding. I find enjoyment doing that. And just having this grind was just so nice. I will say, guys, uh, for me personally, I'm sure it's going to be different for everyone. For me personally, the hardest category of weapons, obviously again, I didn't do melees, I didn't do rocket launchers, uh, was weirdly enough, shotguns. <laughs> I don't know why, getting headshots for the um, KV broadside and then the new guardian shotgun was low-key hard. I spent like two hours alone completing uh, shotguns. It was a pain. And one class that ended up being the easiest, which I didn't honestly expect at all, was pistols. Okay. Pistols were really easy. I got a hit marker. 
I, another hit marker? That's crazy, bro. Hit marker with the intervention is crazy. Might have to be careful. I can't get... Okay, I was going to say, I can't get too nasty with it. Because I don't want to actually complete it. Alright, let's see. How many did we actually end up getting that game? Ooh, 10 out of 25. Okay, I need to remember that. We have 10 out of 25. I just can't believe it, guys. I can't believe, like, this is it. Like, it's hard to fathom that I'm about to be done. Like, I... You guys, like I said, I, I'm a grinder. I love grinding. And I just... I don't want it to be over. I love... I love grinding this game so much. That's not a head. I missed. That was a head. That's 11. 12. Dude. Bro was AFK and I missed. I'm thinking too much about it now. I'm thinking too much. Alright, that's 13. No, 12. I don't know. Oh, nice headshot. That's 14. Bro, I was doing so good last game. I don't know what happened. Probably skill based matchmaking. Skill based. Oh, 15. Skill based bullets, dude. 16. It's not that many videos on Orion came on this game. Uh, 17, I believe. 18. Imagine that I accidentally unlock it. 20. 21. Okay, I believe that's oh, collateral. There's 22, I believe. 23. Oh, I'm scared. I, I'm gonna back out now because if I was off, I, I don't want to accidentally get it. If my counting was correct, I need... I need two. Okay, I was a little off. I actually need three. Woo! Alright. This could be it, guys. This could be freaking it. So I need two headshots before... Oh my god, dude, this is so zoomed in. Holy cow. We need two headshots before uh, going for the trick shot here. There's a kill, but not a headshot. Oh, there's a headshot. There it is. Chat, we are one long shot away. Alright, so here's what we're going to do, alright? So we're going to go to our settings. Obviously, we need to turn up our sensitivity. Let's go to 12. I feel like that would be good. Alright, here we go. Can we hit a trick shot? Again, nothing crazy. See, the bad part is it has to be a headshot. This could literally take me hours. <laughs> uh, it could literally take me hours. Like I said, I'm just going for like a simple 360 maybe. Or something, you know, something not too crazy, but... I'm on your six. Guys, I've been in this game like the whole time. I'm struggling so bad. I, I suck so much at trying to go for these. Holy frick! Enemy has kept oh, I thought I was gonna. I low key thought I was gonna hit that one. That it felt good. It felt like it. I got it! Oh my god, it popped up! I did it! Oh my god, I freaking did it, guys! Oh my god, guys, there it is! It's Orion! Orion unlocked. Can we not? Can't see unlocks? Oh damn it, okay. That's the last time we'll get to see that. Oh my god, guys. There it is. Oh, Ryan. <laughs> oh my god, we did it. It it wasn't as good as of a trick shot as I wanted, but it, hell, it was a trick shot. It was a little bit of a 360, so I I'm happy with that. Oh my goodness, look at this, guys. Look at this. 
Look at that, baby. We got Orion. Once again, guys, smash a like on today's video. Subscribe and ding that bell, guys. We just unlocked fucking Orion camo here in Model for 2. Almost, almost accidentally just said Polyatomic. So if you guys actually played the game when it very first came out, you guys probably know there was actually a glitch where if you went to private match and you started a, a Call of Duty League private match and then you went over to your weapons, you could actually equip any camo onto your guns and this is how a lot of people got gameplay including myself with orion camo because if you actually go to my channel i have a video where i play with orion it was using this camo glitch uh and finally after i believe eight nine months i can actually say i have unlocked orion for real now this is just absurd Alright guys, so we loaded into the private match here. I want to show you guys what the camo looks like on some different guns. So here's the Tempest looking pretty nice. Dude, I can't believe that I actually have it, dude. Like, it's so crazy. Well, here it is on the M4. Just looking fantastic as always it looks it just looks so good guys it <laughs> looks so good here it is on the ftac siege dual wields dude it just looks so good it's a dope inspect by the way like what a dope inspect such a weird reload animation but dope inspect here it is on the scar I actually have a blueprint on this um it's not one i own it's actually glitch blueprint but it's still looking very nice this will probably be the weapon I use most of the time. Now that I'm I'm pretty much done, my scar is usually my go-to. And boy, oh boy, it does not disappoint. Next, we have it up on the M13. I'm using the hazardous blueprint to showcase it. You guys, see what it looks like. So one thing I'm really glad they were able to do really well in this game is the camo coverage. Like, I remember Cold War had some pretty bad camo coverage, but this game has had some really good camo coverage. Here it is on the um, Hemlock Unchained Fury blueprint. You can see it kind of shines through there on some of the little snippets, and then, then you can see the dragon in the middle, and when the dragon's not there, it's actually just full of Ryan. Pretty sick. This is like when he ADS. Very cool, very cool. And then we got the uh, GS Magnus. Goodness gracious, dude. Look at that. Beautiful. Except we have the brand new shotgun, the MX Guardian. It's actually a very good weapon to show off camos on because it's just so massive. I know it's not the best looking camo, like we've had better mastery camos, but it, it's a good one. I really do like it. And then finally guys, the MCPR, my favorite sniper in the game. Uh, this is not exactly the build that I usually use, but it, it's pretty close. It's got most of the attachments on there, like that. Oh, so good, man, so good. Oh, guys, I am so happy to be done. But I'm also not, like I said in the beginning, man, as I really loved the grind. It was just so much fun. And it's not technically over, I still got guns like the M16. If we head over to challenges, um, I can actually see here, like, I'm missing 92 out of 96. Uh, I've done all those and all those. 42 out of 48, 48 out of 48, 45 out of 64. I, I didn't do a lot of these. I didn't do the EBR, LMS, uh, Lockwood, TAC-Q, Crossbow. Uh, did all the snipers, did all the handguns. Didn't do a single launcher. Uh, and then I did some melees. I did the combat knife and then dual kadachis. Um... And then somehow I got Polydomic for this. But yeah, I mean, like I said, the grind's technically not over. There's a few more guns that I can do. But uh, I'm really excited to do them and continue this grind. I'm, I'm a little sad it's over, but I'm glad to, to have done it. Uh, once again, guys, I highly suggest you guys give this a go for yourselves, whether you're starting fresh or whether you hit a roadblock at some point or just lost interest in the game or continuing the grind. I, I suggest you guys give it another shot. Uh, it was really easy um, and it was so easy that it's enjoyable. Like it's not a stressful thing. It's, it's just something you can kind of sit back, 
relax, and do. The long shot phase is a little frustrating, but it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. Uh, like I said, just play hardcore. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Once again, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe, and ding the bell so you guys don't miss out on any future videos. Make sure to join the Discord server link down in the description. Guys, I can finally say I have unlocked Orion Camo in Modern Warfare 2. I love you guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.